With the recent wildfire that was kindled on Tuesday, the Riley County Fire Department has been very active in putting out fires, starting by prescribed burnings over the past month. Channel 8 reporter Blake Crawford has the story. A wildfire started Tuesday in North Riley County has been declared a local disaster by the Riley County Commissioners. Riley County Fire Department Chief Douglas Russell has had to give out three citations to farmers this season for not following their burn permits. We just have people, oh, we're going to go burn it, um, and they don't follow the proper channels to get their burn, make sure their burn permit's valid, and they just go light it, and then it gets away from them, and then it just creates a whole other issue and a safety issue for everybody at that point. Freshman ag student at K-State, Hannah Whetstone, says something as simple as a change in wind direction can be the catalyst for a wildfire. The biggest reason that like a fire might get out of control is literally just the wind changing direction, and it causes the fire to go where we don't want it. Whetstone says something as simple as throwing a cigarette out on the highway or even a mouse catching on fire and moving to a different field could be the catalyst for a wildfire. And with prescribed burnings happening all over Kansas, this is by far the busiest time of the year for Russell. We run uh, pretty close to 800 calls a year average and this time of year is we've already ran I believe 118 Calls. Russell says the workload has taken a toll on the firefighting volunteers, but they still show up when they are needed the most. People get fatigued and tired. Um, we ran calls for like four or five days in a row, multiple hours and hours of calls. But the good thing is our volunteers, um, they love doing this and they, they still keep showing up. In Manhattan, Blake Crawford, Channel 8 News.